Yes, look at the time fly. Perfect. Now let's get out of here. So ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Uh, we're going from Madrid to somewhere other, and uh, we're going to uh, complete one of the cruising Iberia challenges. And uh, we're going to talk about a little bit of the truck, a little bit of the map, and everything like this. So, uh, what we have here is the new Renault uh, T Evolution series. Uh, let's uh, go from here and I will show you. Right now, we're doing a haul with a World of Trucks contract, so let's go to... Here's the truck, with all its glory. As you can see, beautifully, beautifully made. I cannot drive from the outside, so excuse me. And uh, we are going, if I can show you... Right now we are at Almaraz and we are going to Badajoz and uh, we will be completing uh, one of the challenges there. Now, let's go there. I'm gonna put a nice cruise control because I'm lazy. So let's check out the truck a little bit here. Uh, as you can see, everything is working beautifully. All right, and if I can change here, we can see fuel, uh, oil temperatures. Here's the fuel gauges, add blue, and everything. Our air pressure, beautiful, and of course the map changes as well, which is fantastic. I have my water here ready to go, my SES air freshener. Some uh, water extra, my heater truck's a little pillow, and we're good to go. So, something I should tell you is that I have seen uh, some of the community members not liking this new DLC Iberia, uh, mostly because they say that it is uh, mostly motorways and not like tight uh, roads or anything challenging. I am. Um, I have to agree to some extent, although it is beautifully made, as you can see uh, now we're actually going uh, in a tunnel. Sorry. So here we are in a tunnel. And um, well, yes, it is mostly motorways. There's nothing uh, too um, challenging or like small tight roads or anything like that. However, I think the, the map is amazingly made but they have added some really nice features uh, they have added uh, all sorts of new prefabs models all the good stuff like that as well as uh, they have added some new company prefabs as well uh, which is really nicely made as well as making it challenging to actually find where you have to park the trailer or where you have to find the trailer etc uh, etc et once we get to the uh, to our destination I will actually show you what I mean and I will uh, actually show you the uh, outside of the truck as well. Uh, which I believe is quite beautiful. So right now we are on uh, the motorway. I'm going to complete one of our cruising Iberia challenges. And of course in order for you to do this you need to have a uh, uh, your profile linked to the world of trucks. Which of course I have and you should too. Go do it. And of course, big thanks to uh, SES Software for providing me with a key. Uh, big shout out to the SES Software. Since we are on the freeway, uh, I was thinking about maybe doing a, uh, a a renew on some of my most popular videos, like how to uh, extract the SES files, uh, how to do some basic definitions, 
stuff like that. What do you think? What do you guys say? Would you like to see that? Comments below. I think we're almost there. Yep, there's the sign. Let's uh, see the sign. Yep, we're going to that one there. Badajoz. Badajoz. I'm not sure uh, how to pronounce this one. Either way, it will be fun. If you're wondering what's wiggling on the steering wheel, that's just a flag on the top of the uh, top of the truck. Really lovely interior, I have to say. Okay, we're almost there. Here you can see some uh, nice view. As we pass by. Here's our exit. Okay. We're good to go. So as you can see, although we are at Badai, Badajoz, uh, something like this, it's not really a city. It's just one road leading to the actual uh, company. Not much to see. Still. Not half bad, if you ask me. Okay, let's see where we are going now. Alright. I think we are here. Perfect. So, here we are. Now, of course, I'm going to choose uh, where do you need it. So. And they need it... Alright, let's uh, see where they need it, actually. Here's the truck, in all its glory. 
beautiful truck. So, let's see what we have. Is it here? It is here. Uh, I went the wrong way though, so I have to make a I have to make a turn. So as you can see, new prefabs, as I said. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So I'm gonna make a quick turn here. Nice. Lovely. Easy peasy. So here we are. Let's line it up nicely. And let's put some clips. Okay. Here we are. Delivered. And that's it. Perfect. Nice. And as you can see, I have completed uh, right now five of them and I have 20, uh, another 15 to go. Let's actually see the truck in a little bit. Here it is. Stunning, I think. Now, as I said, of course, this is not a modded version, so the uh, uh, you know the customization options, shall we say, it's uh, pretty standard. However, once the modifications come around, ah, oh, it's gonna be amazing. All right, so uh, this is JCV uh, coming to you. And I uh, hope you like this video. Please like, share, and subscribe. Also, comment if you want to. And, uh, well, see you in the next one. Take care.